I want to say thank y'all so much for all of this. Mr. Haney watching, that's crazy to me because he was one of my favorite teachers, Ms. Edelman and Ms. Gephardt, for all of some of my favorite just people at BCIT and Dr. Holly. What up, girl? <laughs> thank you so much for even just having me back. Like, and it feels so crazy to see a welcome home and that's so cool to me. Um, the whole journey has been a nothing short of a blessing. And God has been in the forefront for me. He's been in control of my life and has been guiding my steps. And with encouragement from my peers and my family, for real, for real, it was their constant uh, reassuring, letting me know that, yes, this is a hard road ahead of you, but go ahead and just try it. We don't know what's to, what's to come. So as opposed to being afraid of going out for that thing that you want, your dream, just go chase it. And it's been such a fun journey these last four years chasing my dream. God has been blessing me tremendously, like tremendously. I started uh, writing music in BCIT. Like I just started rapping in the lunch tables, laughing with some of my friends and in ad art, when I should have been working on some homework assignments and stuff, I was like writing raps and singing and having just the most fun. And right now it's such a pivotal moment just for everyone watching and, and all the students, especially because at BCIT is where I learned how to hone in on what I wanted to be for the rest of my life. Not saying that I learned how to songwrite at BCIT, but I learned how to approach, uh, approach life uh, with some of the lessons that I learned uh, going through BCIT. And it's just been uh, a phenomenal experience since I graduated to right now.